Ladies and gentlemen, what is up? Welcome to this episode of Let's Discuss. And today I got an important topic that we got to talk about. And that is the Blaze Blue tag battle live streaming restrictions being laid out on Twitter by Arc System Works. Now, some of you have been viewers of mine for a very long time. So you guys know I have my history with Arc System Works and their uh, live streaming restrictions, even though in past games they didn't really announce the the restrictions that they had on their games um so this isn't anything new but this is the first time that i feel like they actually addressed a problem that they claim they were having with uh live streamers in their games so it goes like this uh back in like 2000 it was like a couple years ago i would say 2015 2016 i uploaded footage of uh the Guilty Gear and Exard uh, game and all the videos that I had ended up getting taken down because of the uh, copyright strikes that Arc System, Work, Arc System Works um, uh, gave me and you know they never responded to me when I tried to get them taken down uh, get, get the copyright strikes removed even though the videos were removed off my channel before the copyright strikes took place it was just like you know it still happened but nevertheless um these are the rules that they laid out and this was on their twitter uh so this is just like a clearer picture of what they had on their twitter it was just it would have been too small if i would have just read it off of there but this happened yesterday and it's a a note about streaming and uploading content from blaze blue cross tag battle this is an important and awesome time for us here at arc system works blaze blue cross tag battle is finally out and on the verge of coming out in the west and now you really can't escape from crossing fate the arc system the arc teams have spent some serious time working hard to make sure blaze blue tag the bb tag is a fun and accessible fighting game for new and old fans alike it's it's hard to wrap our minds around the journey towards such being such towards launch being over but here we are from announcement to launch it's been a crazy ride but which brings us to this important topic streaming and uploading content from blaze blue cross tag battle and we want to give you the freedom to upload your amazing matches and online shenanigans however when it comes to story mode that is where most of the restrictions and guidelines will reside and we want to make sure fans get to experience the episode mode with fresh eyes and to that end our video streaming guidelines are as follows do's and don'ts right here this is where the, the big meat and potatoes of everything comes into play um do stream matches now these are the things that they allow uh, for those of you who don't understand this i don't know why but just in case the do's what you are allowed to do is stream matches to your heart's content either against other players local or online or against the computer showing off your mad skills to put together tutorial videos to break down characters team strategies or show how to pull off that amazing combo more power to you three show us those online shenanigans dance parties and the like <laughs> now the do nots what you cannot do is stream episode mode at all just don't if you have to very short clips of episode mode content up to chapter two are permitted for video content only and longer clips spoilers or anything else is a danger area so really just avoid this altogether two stream or upload any music any music only content music playing in the background during matches online lobbies and etc are totally fine a soundtrack rip or upload is not so all those channels out there that want to upload just the music from the game even though the game might have some great music you know they're advising don't do it otherwise you're risking getting a copyright strike and the video is going to get taken down if you care about your youtube channel i know they got some channels out there that just don't care so more power to you and then they also give this uh this last little bit you know like the fine print down here at the bottom and say these rules in general apply across the board with arc system works games we understand how much you how much work you put into your channels and love and appreciate you supporting us by creating content from our games unfortunately these rules are non-negotiable with the powers that be and will result in your channel being issued a content id claim or worse a channel strike slash account suspicion suspension we don't want this to happen because of us so please heed the rules above so there you go it's laid out flat you can upload any matches that you have any 
thing that has to do with the online mode you can upload it but as far as like the story mode the episode mode it's their um policy that they want people to be able to experience it um you know as something new and they don't want any online you know spoilers and things like that so um So with that being said, man, um, anybody who wanted to do this, uh, of course, you got to take things into your own risk uh, when you upload this stuff. Um, you know, they're advising you not to do it. They're telling you now, because unlike with, you know, the, uh, unlike with past games, um, like games like Guilty Gear XR, in my experience with that, games like Guilty Gear XR, when they didn't announce this, um, I didn't know it was against the rules. Like, they, they, they never said anything. So, you know, it's just one of those things that it's just like, okay, at least now you're saying something. Now you're telling us, you know, because before you were just, you know, taking down channels and people didn't know why. Like, you didn't want people uploading footage of your games. At least now they laid out the ground rules and we can get a better understanding as to what we can and what we can't do with the game. So, you know, it sucks, but at the same time, you know, they have their reasons for why they want people to... Uh, you know, not advertise the story mode. The story mode may be something special that they want people to not spoil it through live streaming, which is understandable, you know, depending on how hard they worked on it, because they didn't work hard on the combat at all, at all. Um, but regardless, it's something that should be taken seriously and you know it's something that should be respected so i mean it's their game at the end of the day and you know even though a lot of companies look at you know things like that as um as like free advertising at the same time it's people out there that won't buy the game if they already seen the story mode and i think they looking at it from a business perspective more so than uh than a competitive standpoint and you know, there's always, like I always said about many times before, there's always the common sense of business and there's always the common sense of competition. And this is kind of one of those weird gray areas where the two kind of mix. They're okay with the competitive nature of the game, but they're not okay with, with you know, messing with the, um, the story mode and ruining potential sales for them. Because um, I think seeing four different games come together in a crossover game like this you know you want to know what brought all these guys together was it some weird portal opening up was it some magic or maybe they were all living in the same universe to begin with just in different parts of the world so you know like you never know um but regardless that's not something that they want spoiled and it's honestly it's okay with me but now that i know this <laughs> unlike with guilty gear exar now that i know this i know what i can do and what i can't do so I don't have to risk getting in trouble and now that I brought the information to you, you don't have to worry about risking getting in trouble either. So there you go. Uh, the link to this is going to be in the description if you guys want to check it out. Um, the link straight, strictly to the uh, to the page. So I'm just letting you guys know. And uh, yeah, that's it. Peace. Keep on gaming. And don't live stream this episode mode slash story mode. You'll get in trouble. Don't upload music. Um, don't don't up, don't up, don't upload the music rips. Um, if the music is in the matches, it's fine. If not, you know, if, if it's just plain music you're uploading from the game, you're gonna get in trouble. You're gonna have a bad time. Don't have a bad time. Until next time, peace. Keep on gaming.